42. Angel reporting in. All right, boys and girls, I really wish I could fill you in on what I've been doing for the last couple of weeks, but apparently that goes beyond even my level of comprehension, which is basically my way of saying I don't remember. So, without further ado, I'm just going to do a short one tonight and then go pass out. I'm not completely, entirely, positively, 100% sure, but it kind of feels like someone slipped some chloroform into my drink. That being said, item SCP-904, the short poem, object class, Euclid, special containment procedures. SCP-904 should be inscribed on an ordinary sheet of typing paper when not in active observation or study. This paper should be secured in a secure, locked, non-combination vault and stored out of range of any recording devices. SCP-904 should only be handled or directly viewed by Class D personnel without backgrounds in literature, writing, or art. Any personnel viewing SCP-904 experiencing hallucinations or suicidal thoughts should be removed immediately from the situation. Description SCP-904 was discovered scratched on a bathroom wall in the literature department of university. After reports of unusual behavior and difficulty speaking in approximately 300 students and staff, Mobile Task Force EDA-10, the Ceno Evil Unit, was sent to contain it after its viral nature was realized. And although all three Class D personnel involved in its transport were infected by visual contact, it was transported to Site X without incident. SCP-904 presents a slight mimetic hazard to all who read it, but it is only harmful to those with a very specific creative type mindset. An infected individual can infect other individuals. Symptoms include the tendency to use end rhymes uncontrollably in all speech. Reading SCP-904 multiple times or being very close to it after reading it once will result in the development of a more refined poetic form containing iambic pentameter, and more complicated poetic form, or more fitting rhymes. The infection is not permanent. Some individuals will remain affected for up to 24 hours, while others will shake off the infection within 10 minutes. Typically, infections caught from other individuals will be shorter in duration than infections from the source. However, some individuals, mostly those with backgrounds in poetry and the arts, are more adversely affected by the infection. These individuals have a more difficult time losing the infection. In rare cases, it will not subside, but will induce hallucinations regarding being trapped in cages, coffins, or otherwise. A state of extreme depression, and the feeling that they are unable to express their thoughts or that their body is not theirs anymore, or that it's being possessed. Often the subject will choose to self-terminate. Researchers should use discretion when choosing who will view SCP-904. Well, I can't say that the rhyming part of SCP-904 isn't fun to watch sometimes, but it is a little unsettling to just watch D-classes off themselves. So I recommend staying away from this one. Okay, I'm really seriously starting to feel a little bit dizzy now. I'm going to go lay down. So remember, stay safe, stay alert, and I can't think of anything that rhymes with alert. <laughs>